When a ray of light approaches an interface of another medium, three different incidents may occur. A portion of the ray travels back to first medium. It is called the reflection of light. A second portion enters the second medium. It is the refraction of light. And a third portion get absorbed by the interface. This is known as absorption of light. So, what is reflection of light? When a ray of light travels to the interface of another medium, a portion of the ray travels back to the first medium. This incidence is called reflection of light. We all notice reflection on mirrors, on water surfaces, on smooth metallic surfaces. These are the examples of reflection. Before explaining the laws of reflection, let's see some terms related to reflection. The ray of light that approaches the interface is called the incident ray. And the ray that reflected back is called reflected ray. A perpendicular to the plane at the point of incidence is known as normal. The angle between the normal and the incident ray is called angle of incidence. And the angle between the normal and the reflected ray is called angle of reflection. Now, let's see the first law of reflection. It says, the incident ray, the normal to the plane of the interface, and the reflected ray. They all lie on same plane. Suppose, another ray of light, travels to that point, from a different direction. Then, incident ray, normal, and reflected ray, may not lie on the previous plane. They may be placed on another plane. Second law of reflection. It is very easy to understand. It says, the angle of incidence is equal to the angle of reflection. These are the two laws that reflection of light maintains. Hope you realized the topic. Write us in the comment section if you have any query regarding the topic. Tell us which topic you want from us in 3D animation. Help us to grow this channel. Consider a thank or purchase a membership. A member can personally request any type of question answer on physics, maths and chemistry.